Yo, what's up? You know what's weird to me? Bad YouTubers are almost always boys. I've done over 50 videos on bad YouTubers. Most of the time, we look at like three YouTubers in each video, so that's 150 bad YouTubers that I've looked at. And I've only made a video on about three girls ever. And that's about to change right now. The other day, I was thinking to myself, why in the world are all of the bad YouTubers some dudes? And at that moment, I knew I needed to find the worst girl on YouTube, but it's not gonna be easy. I don't just wanna find a random girl and say, hey guys, she's the worst because she's so cringy. I wanna go crazy. So for this video, I went out and I looked at over 50 different girl YouTube channels to try to find the very worst one. And by the end of this video, once we decide who the worst girl on YouTube truly is, I'm gonna try to message her and see if I can convince her to start making better videos. And I hope my girlfriend doesn't get mad at me. On my channel, we try to clean up the bad content on YouTube. So if you want to help me make YouTube a better place, click subscribe. And if you don't want to subscribe, that's completely fine. Just sit back and enjoy my videos. Did you know that I had a second channel? You can go ahead and subscribe to my second channel. It's all about you. You tell me what videos to make over there. It's pretty awesome. So for the first girl, I found her in a really weird way. Just let me explain. It was December 31st. Me and my girlfriend were at this wedding. The night was fun, all that. When we got home, we didn't really have much to do. We were just waiting for the new year. And that's when it went all downhill. So basically, we're both sitting on the couch and I'm looking at her phone and she's on YouTube. And I ended up seeing a whole bunch of horrible YouTubers all over her recommended, but I didn't really think too much of it. 20 minutes later, I was in my room, probably making a video or doing something. And all of a sudden, I heard some girl talking about, we bought a Clifford the Red Dog potion. That made me jump out of my chair. What the f is my girlfriend watching on YouTube? I ran over to her to see what she was watching and I was about to vomit. She told me she was watching it because she found this cringy girl and she was laughing at it. A few days later, I just kept thinking about that video. What normal person would make their dog drink a Clifford potion? I couldn't hold the urge any longer. I had to watch the video. Ah, my ears. Why is it so loud? And what in the world did she just say? We just ordered the Clifford potion, guys. From the dark web at 3 a.m. Oh my god, guys, someone's knocking already on the door! Oh someone's god. knocking on the door! Oh my god, guys, guys, it's literally 3 a.m. Oh my god, guys, that was the fastest delivery ever, guys! Oh my god, guys! I've heard people say, oh my god, guys, but I've never heard somebody say, oh my god, guy. It must be something new for 2022. The potion arrived at their house, and I don't even know what to expect. I wouldn't be surprised if, like, Steve from Minecraft was at the door, or Santa, or something like that. Oh my god! That's the grave! Whoa! Grace! What do you want? Okay, I'm lost. The title of this video says Giving Clifford Potion to My Puppy at 3 a.m. Why is the Grinch in your house? Oh my god, guys, we got some water and we put some coloring in it. Oh my god, guys, she's drinking the potion of Clifford. Oh my god, guys, she's drinking the potion of Clifford. Oh my god, my cat is eating food. Oh, what's happening? Oh, she's getting hyper. Whoa, look. Oh my god, what's happening? Yo, you see that? Oh my god, that's so good. Whoa, oh, look. So after the dog had a seizure, they went outside and found a red Freddy Fazbear? What? How does that make any sense? I swear, these people love to bully their dog because they made a video where Pennywise stole their dog and their car at 3 a.m. Like, bro, what did the dog even do to deserve this? Oh my god, guys, the movie is playing, and as you can see, it's the birthday of Lily, guys. <laughs> So it's our dog's birthday, so she's gonna get kidnapped by Pennywise. Hey, Pennywise. Pennywise, Pennywise, stop! 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 Oh my god, get out of his house. What are those baby slaps gonna do? Punch him. And here's where I actually got mad. 
at this girl. The videos are obviously fake, right? But watch this. This is just too far. Oh my god, he's going outside of the house. Oh my god, guys. Can you guys stole me? Oh my god. Did you hear the dog whining? They had their friend come take their dog into the cold weather outside with a scary costume on. The dog was crying and they just kept recording. They kept filming it. Do they even care about their dog? Like, it gets worse. Watch. Oh my god. Where is Pennywise going? Guys, what should I do? Oh my god, dogs. Oh my god, where did he go? Oh my god, he went in the... Hmm, where did he go? Huh, I have no idea. Hey, Pennywise. What the hell? Pennywise took the car. Pennywise, stay here. Stay here. Pennywise. Okay, yeah, so somebody's breaking into your car, but let's just stand right there, tap on the car a couple times, and tell him to stop. He drives away with the car, and she's like, we have to go inside. He's too strong. Like, bro, he has your dog still. I ended up watching a few more videos from this Alice girl, and I knew what I had to do. I needed to find some more horrible girls, but I had to do something about this girl, so I messaged her on Instagram, and you'll see if she answers later on in this video. I remembered that I made a video about the most cringy girl on YouTube more than two years ago. That was Rebecca Zamolo, or Zamalo, I still don't know her name. Two years ago, she was super cringy. I needed to know if she was still cringy. Matt! Maddie! Come here! Something isn't right! Uh. <laughs> Rebecca, what's wrong? What's happening? I don't know! It just keeps getting bigger! I woke up and it So you're telling me she's still posting videos about being pregnant? She was doing that two years ago, and now she's still doing it? It's the yes, no challenge. I will be holding an item over your head, but you can't see it if you say yes, and you keep the item, but if you say no, you don't get it, so good luck. Item number one, yes or no? I'm going with no. No. Oh, that was a big mistake. You could have had $10,000. $10,000? But you said no. Item yep, she's still cringy, just like I remember her. Being a kid is so much better than being an adult, right, Polly? Katie, you better not tell mom that I'm using her china. She's literally acting like a kid. Remember, she's like 37 years old. That's like your mom doing this stuff. Just imagine your mom making videos like this. I want to look at a girl that posts the nastiest videos ever. We haven't looked at her in a pretty long time, though, so I'm pretty sure there's going to be some new weird stuff on her channel. So I really didn't know what to expect when I got to her channel. Would it be better? Would it be worse? Who knows? I found a video that says, breaking up with my boyfriend for 24 hours. He cheated on me. You guys are 14 years old and already cheating on people? We're gonna be doing a challenge and a very hard challenge for me, hopefully my boyfriend. We're doing the breakup challenge. Wait, what? Yeah, we're gonna see what it's like if- Viper, Jayana, and Clayton never exist. Okay, so they're breaking up, nice. Nice. After I do this, Viper's over. Three, two, one. <gasps> oh my gosh, nuh uh. They unfollowed them on Instagram? There's just no way. She posted a video where she put being mean to my maid on her birthday. I'm not even gonna say anything about that. Okay, so I was just suffering, watching one of her videos, trying to find the worst one to put in this video, and I found this. Once we, like, learned how to be a lifeguard, we're actually gonna go to Rebecca's house and, you know, show her our moves. And yeah, guys, so you're gonna be- What? Two of the worst girls on YouTube did a collab? I honestly don't think I can watch this. You, I, I don't even know. No, I won't go in the hot tub then. Yes. That's fine. Hot tub I mean, closed, water go. slides, no. Got it. But what happens if someone- no! oh, God! So 14 year old kids hanging out with people who are old enough to be their parents and they're all screaming throughout the whole 33 minute video? This is the best video ever. Baby, if it's okay. Are you giving birth? Check the water okay. There's a heartbeat. How can we check if the water broke? I don't know. Water everywhere. Oh my God, there's so much water. Okay. Is she okay? Is the baby okay? Is the baby okay? Let me see, something's coming out of me. Ask the baby if it's okay? What? Bro, Rebecca Zamolo, Zamala, whatever, has acted like she is giving birth so many times as a prank in these videos that when she's actually about to give birth, nobody's gonna believe her. They're just gonna be like, ha, huh, nice prank. You've pulled this prank on me 20 times before and she's gonna be dying over there shooting out a baby. Piper Raquel and Rebecca Zamolo are both cringe, but this video is for the worst girl, not the cringiest, and we know that the Alice at 3 a.m. Spy Ninja, whatever the, her name is, is the worst girl on YouTube. 
She literally uses her dog for these dumb videos and the dog doesn't like it. So here's what I did about that. I went over to her Instagram to message her and I said, is there any reason you make 3 a.m. videos instead of normal videos? But I didn't really expect to get an answer. I expected her to ignore me. So I had to do something else. I had to dive deeper and that's when I decided to go into detective mode. I knew that she wasn't going to answer me. So what could we find in her videos that would help us get closer to talking to her? Now, if you remember, she has a boyfriend in those videos. My plan was to somehow figure out who this mystery guy was and find his Instagram or Twitter or anything. I needed to figure out why they made these videos and I kind of wanted to figure out if they ever got that dog back from Pennywise. I'll be sure to ask him. So the first step of this plan is to look at who Alice is following on Instagram because it's normal for boyfriends and girlfriends to follow each other on Instagram, right? There's a problem with that though. She doesn't follow anybody on Instagram. I found somebody though that might be her boyfriend. So on every single video she posted on Instagram, there's one account who comments like three times per video. Most of the time it's like three emojis though. It's like a crying emoji, happy emoji, clapping emoji. Is that her boyfriend? Yeah, never mind. I don't think that is. <laughs> I was searching everywhere for this dude and I finally might have found him. So in a video where they turn into the imposter at 3 a.m., they start playing Among Us. And I wanted to see if I could see his username while he was playing the game because if it said like Felix, then I could look for a Felix and try to find him. But his username just said me. Wow, this guy is very sneaky. But then I found something else. In a video titled, Nobody Came to Her Chuck E. Cheese Birthday Party, he said, Nobody came to my sister's birthday. No one came to my sister's birthday party. Their brother and sister, that helps a lot. I still couldn't find this dude. I found the girl, no problem, but this dude is a ninja. It's January 17th now. More than two weeks have passed since the last part of this video. After I was searching for a while for this guy, I gave up. I thought I would never find him, but then I got a message. A message from a few of my friends. A couple weeks ago, I told them that I couldn't find this dude and they just found him for me. I'm not sure how, but they did. And his name is Fresh Freddy. I found something odd on Fresh Freddy's channel. Remember how his sister Alice posted something about how nobody came to her birthday party or whatever? Well, her brother did the same exact video, but with him. Remember when Alice's dog was having a seizure after drinking that Clifford potion? He made the same exact video as her. There's the potion of Clifford! We just got the potion! Why are they posting the same videos? At that moment, I went to his video, found his Instagram and Twitter in his description, and I went out to message him. His sister didn't answer me, probably because she thought I was a 75 year old creep or something, but this guy's gonna answer me, right? Whenever I looked at both of their channels though, I couldn't see how many subscribers they had. I was really mad about that. Each video had around like 10 to 20,000 views, so I was thinking that they had about 70,000 subscribers. On Fresh Freddy's Twitter, the girl's brother, his name says Fresh Freddy. 250,000 subscribers. You're telling me the dude who gave his dog red liquid has 250,000 people subscribed to him? That doesn't make any sense. So I messaged this Freddy dude on January 17th and the next day I checked my messages and he didn't answer me. Just like his sister, I don't think I'm gonna get a message from either of these people. They're ignoring me. I don't know why they're ignoring me though. Like, well, Actually, I know why they won't answer me. They're too busy torturing their dog for views on YouTube. There's some really weird scamming going on on YouTube right now, and that's what I'm going to go look at in my next video. I got to go work on that right now. Be ready for my next video. We're going to take down some YouTube scammers.